two primary scales, all right, that is used in Western music in almost every song in Western music, all right? And that is the major scale. And that is the minor scale. Okay? These scales are also relative to each other. I'll get into that. I'll get into that later, all right? So these, this is the major scale, all right? Starting from D. Oh, let's actually, let me go back. I didn't talk about these letters here. So what are these? So this is the sequence that creates the major scale, all right? This is a, the, the, the half step, the whole step, the whole step sequence that is used to create ev all the 12 major scales, all right? If you know this, you can pretty, you know every scale, all right? If you know this, you know how to build every scale. Simple. You know how to build every scale, all right? So let's just, let's, um, let's, let me go over real quick. So the major scale is whole step, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step, whole step, half step, all right? That's the ma that's the major scale, all right. So I'm gonna show you that when I when we start getting to like when I'm started to when I start to teach you how to do this how to play the scales, all right. And the minor step minor scale is whole step half step, whole step whole step half step whole step whole step, all right. So you want you want to write this down. You can take a screenshot. You can take a picture. It's right there. You can take you can do that right now. You can pause the video and write it down, all right. So that's um that's the C major scale right here. For example, C whole step. Remember, whole step is two half steps. So we have C, one two whole step, one two whole step. There's no black key, so it's always a half step. So E to F half step, whole step one two whole step one two whole step one two half step. Boom, just like that. All right. So how do I play the scales? That's what we're gonna get into right now. As we right, so you can see my keys. Okay, so the first scale we're going to learn how to play is the C major scale, all right? So the C major scale, remember this is C, all right? We established the notes. We all know the notes, all right? If you need to, if you think like you really need to, you can go, you can buy the little stickers, the piano stickers. You can go, you can go and buy them and you can label them from A, B, C, D, E, F. Um, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, A. You can label them from there. You can label them from C. C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C. You can do that if you want to. So, if you want, if you still haven't, like, try to, like, if you still think it's kind of hard for you to know the notes already. All right? But if you remember them of, of like, first try, like that, you're good. All right? So, we're on C. And remember, the sequence is... Whole step, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step, whole step, half step. All right. So remember, that's a whole step, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step, whole step, half step. All right. This is a half step because you're starting from this note and you go to that note. All right. So. All right, so enough of me playing. Let's let's let me teach you how to play the um the C major scale. Let me teach you how to play the C major scale. I don't know why I said that twice. My bad. All right, <laughs> so let me tell you this right now. Once uh, let me tell you this right now before I even start. So the fingering that you're gonna learn for the C major scale is applicable for the C major scale, the D major scale, the E major scale, the the G major scale and the A major scale, all right? So, the A minor scale, actually. So, let me talk about that real quick. So, let me talk about that. The Actually, not. Actually, not. When we get into the chords, I'll talk about that. But we, we're going to learn the major scale, all right? So, the C, the C major scale, the D major scale, the E major scale, the G major scale, and the A major scale, all right? Those notes, the scales corresponding to those notes, the fingering is all the same. So you just need to learn one fingering for these. All right. All right. So 
We're going to learn the C major scale. We're going to learn from the, um, the, the right hand, okay? So it's like this. Okay, so how do you play that? Well, it's pretty simple, all right? So you want to get your thumb, all right? So I'm going to give you the numbers, right? So remember when we talked about it was uh, the second video, how to sit in the correct hand positions and, and finger numbers. Second video, if you ever watched it, go watch it so you know how to sit right, you know, and you don't hurt yourself while playing, okay? So you go to that, go to that second video, all right? And your fingers have corresponding numbers. So my thumb is one on both hands. Thumb is one. Pointer is two. Middle is three. Ring is four. Pinky is five. All right. So remember that. All right. One, one. Let me put that out there. One, two, three, four, five. All right. So when I, I'm going to give you the numbers. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Five, four, three, two, one. Three, two, one. All right? So let's, let me show you. So remember, your hands relaxed. You put your hands on your knees and you put it on the keys. All right? Bars. <laughs> so put your hands on the knees. Put your hands on your knees and you put it on the keys. That's, a, that's how your, your hands should be relaxed. All right? You can see that if I turn my hand over, you can see the little C. Remember the little C shape from the, sec from, uh, the second video, all right? The little C shape right there put my hand right there a little c shape you see it it's right there all right make sure it's that okay so put it on there okay so it's your first finger so you play one okay First finger on one, two, three. Okay. So the first sequence, right, on the right hand is one, two, three. Okay. I'm gonna leave I'm gonna leave the um the finger numbers for the scales in the description as well. So you if you need to come back and if you need to see it, I'll leave it in the description as well. Okay. So the first finger, one, two, three. Okay. So this is really vital when it comes to um the scales. The thumb, all right? The thumb movement under is really vital for you to be able to go over here, okay? So you play, you press the, the C, all right? You press the D, okay? You press the E. Once you hit the E, your thumb should be all already under, okay? Tucked under, so you can hit the F. Okay, so we're on C, all right? So we're on C, okay? So one, two, three. You see where my thumb is? One, two, three. You see where my thumb is, right? My thumb is right there. My thumb is on the F already. It's just waiting for the E to stop playing, all right? So one, two, three. It's tucked under. You see it's right there? Four, five, six, okay? I'm count. I'm just I'm counting the notes. I'm just counting the notes, not the fingers yet, all right? So one, two, three three okay make sure that's stuck under and you go to count one again because you're gonna play that the one this is the one remember so one two three tuck one two three four five okay you're gonna play the rest of your five fingers okay so let's do that again okay let's do that slow one one two three tuck the thumb under don't do this all right that's bad don't do that don't do this don't don't do any don't do that just tuck it under all right your hands here tuck it under like that you see I so I didn't have to do this just do that tuck it under do that tuck it under see I was just you so I can just tuck it under there and my hand barely moves you said my hand is not turning look it's right here it's hot it's like it's like a turtle head all right just you just tuck it under there all right so let's do that again two one two three tuck under four 
Okay, let me do it again. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, yeah, let's go down now. Okay, starting from the pinky. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, crossover now. So when we do a crossover, we do that that three, three, two, one. Okay, let's do that one more time. One, two, three, tucked under. One, two, three, four, five. Now we're gonna go down, okay, from the five. Five, four, three, two, one. Three, two, one. Okay. Now we're gonna need to do it for the left hand. Okay. We're gonna need to be. We're gonna need to do it for the left hand. So let's do it like this. No, I don't know what I'm saying. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. So we got the left hand here. Okay. So what the right hand just did after we did the one, two, three, tuck. One, two, three, four, five. The right hand is going to mirror that the opposite way. So what I mean by that is whatever we did first, we're going to do last with the right hand. Okay. So we're, on, we're going to put all our fingers on. Remember, C shaped. Keep it relaxed. All right. Keep it relaxed. C shaped. So what's on the keys is like this. You can see it. Right. Okay. So. This is it right here in its entirety. Okay, that's it right there. So you realize that we didn't cross over first, all right? Because we're doing the opposite. This is so we're doing opposite. So it's like this. If I did it, if I um, if I did it like how I did, like I was doing it with my right hand coming down, it would be the left hand going up. Okay, so when we're doing it in the left hand, it's one, it's five, five, four, three, two, one. All right. Instead of so, you know how we do five, four, three, two, one going down. That's what we're doing going up. So it's five, four, three, two, one. Okay, three, two, one. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Okay? Let's do that again. Five, five, four, three, two, one. Three, two, one. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, my bad. So, that's the left hand for a C major. Now, let's go to D major, okay? Because we're gonna, I'm doing the ones that have the same similar fingerings. All right, I'm doing the one that has that have the similar fingerings. Okay, so D major, which is right here. Okay, so D major is the same fingerings. All right, you're just pressing different notes. So D major is D, E, F sharp, G, A, B. C sharp D Okay So that's the D major scale So it's the same pattern Okay One, two, three Tuck under C Tuck under Okay So one, two, three Tuck One, two, three, four, five Five, four, three, two, one, three, two, one. Okay. It's the same pattern. The same thing with the right hand. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. It's the same thing. Let's go to the E major, which is the same thing again. Okay. So one, two, three, four, five. So one, two, three. One, two, three, four. One. Oh, let me do that again. I'm sorry. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. My bad. One, two, three, four, five. Five, four, three, two, one. Three, two, one. It's the same thing with the right hand. Okay. The right hand. The right hand pattern is the same. Is the same thing. The right hand pattern is a mirror of the left hand pattern. All right. So it's one, two, three, four, five. One, one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Okay.
when we go to the G major, G major is the same pattern, okay? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, okay? Five, four, three, two, one. Three, two, one. Same thing with the right hand. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Okay? So these right here are have the same pattern. Now, when we go into the other scales, that's when the pattern starts to change. Okay? So we just did C, D, E, G, and A because they have the same patterns. Okay? So let's go to F now. All right? F major. Okay, so F major. Okay, so the F major scale is like this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay? Let's do that again. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That's the F major. We're starting on F. Okay? So it's F, G, A. Okay? F, G, A. Okay? Go up to that black note, all right, which is that A sharp. But in this case, we already said A. So if you said A, if you're going, if you're doing a scale, right, and you said the note, you say you said a note, but the note letter is the same after it, you would say B flat. Okay, you would say the flat of that note. Okay, so let me get, let me do that again. So like, you probably thought what I said was probably confusing. So let me say, let me do that. Let me let me try to explain it better. So one two three so it would be a f g a you wouldn't say a because i said a already you would say b flat okay c d e f f e c f e f e d c b flat a g f because if you said a and then a sharp then you know a lot of people get confused and like what are you talking about okay so F G A, then you'd say B flat, C D E F. Okay, so that's for the right hand. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, four. Um. Four, three, two, one, three, four, three, two, one. Okay, for the right hand is one, two, three, is five, four, three, two, one, four, three. No, I'm sorry, five, four, three, two, one, three, two, one, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, let's do that again. One, two, three, five, four, three, two, one, three, two, one. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Let's go to the G sharp. We did G already. So let's go to the G sharp. All right. So let's do the F sharp. Okay, let's do the F sharp on the right hand. Okay, so the numberings, the fingerings are this one, two, three, four. Well, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, one, two, three. No, uh, I'm doing the finger, I'm doing the numbers wrong. Sorry, I'm sorry. So it's like this one, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, two, one, three, two, one, three, two, one, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, two, one, three, two, one, three, two, one. Okay. Okay. Now let's go to the right hand, okay, which is 
one um one four okay four three two one okay four three okay my bad three two one no no four four three two one three two one it can do one or three it's all it's a preference with that one so it's four three two one three two one three okay three is better in my opinion three one three one two three one two three four that was a little bit tricky okay so it's four three two one three two one three three two one two three um one um three one two three one two three four okay so let me do that slow again one two three four three two one um no four i'm sorry i'm so sorry four three two one three two one three three one two three one two three four let me do that one more time because i messed up four three two one three two one three three one two three one two three four okay now let's go to g sharp Okay, so one, we all this is one on the right hand, my bad. So it's one, two, three. So my bad, it'll be one, two, let me wait for this to go away. One, two, three. Okay, one, one, no, two, three, one. I'm sorry, I always, I don't know why I'm doing that. Okay, so it's two, three, one. Two, three, one, two, three, three, one, three, two, one, three, two, one, two, three, two. Okay, let's do that again. Two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, three, two, one, three, two, one. Three two, okay. The right hand is three two one. Three two one. No, four three two. No one. Three two one. My bad. Three two one. Three two one. Okay, my bad. My bad. I took took me a second. All right, so it's three, two, one, three, two, one, three, two. Okay. Two, three, one. Two, three, one, three, two, three, no, three, two. My bad. So three, two, one, three, two, one, three, two, two, three, one, two, three, one. Two, th three, okay. Okay, I don't think I did A major, so let's do that. Um, so it's okay, so A major in the right hand is the same thing as C. the same thing for a major in the 
right here. Okay, let's do A sharp or B flat. Okay, so B flat or A sharp is like this one, you know, it's two, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, four, three, two, one, three, two, one, two, three. My bad. So it's three, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, four, three, two, one, three, two, one, three. Okay. And the right hand is one, two, three. Is no, the right hand is three, two, one, four, three, two, one, three, three, one, two, three, four, one, two, three. Okay, one, two, three, four. So it'll be three, two, one, four, three, two, one, three, three, one, two, three, four, one, two, three. Okay, now the last we have three more scales to go, and we got B. Okay, so let's do C sharp, and then we're gonna do E flat. And B, we're going to save for last because B has two different finger fingerings, all right? So, uh, we're going to save B for last, all right? Okay, the, no the ones we have left are C sharp, E, and B. So, we're going to do C sharp now, all right? So, for the right hand, okay? is two three one two three four one two two one th four three two one three two okay let's do that again two three one two three four one two two one four three two one three two let's do the right hand now Okay, the left hand, I mean, so one, two, three, okay, I've been a little minor setback, so let's do the right hand again, so, so it was one, two, it's three, two, one, four, three, two, one, two, okay, so it's two, one, two, three, four, one, two, three. Now let's go to E major. All right, let me stop. Okay, so for the right hand is one, two, three. Okay, four, five, one, two, three. Okay, let's do that again. One, uh, not not one, two. One two, so two one two three four one two three. Okay, three two one four three two one three. You can do three or two. It doesn't matter which finger you use for that one. Okay, now for the the right hand is three two one four three two one three. Okay, three, two, three, one, two, three, four, one, two, three. Okay. Now, all right. So let's go to the B major. Okay, that's the last scale. Okay. Let's go to the B major. In the right hand, it is one, two, three, four. Okay, no, it's one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five. Five, four, three, two, one, three, two, one. Okay? It's similar to the C, all right? Now, it's similar to the C, so it's the same thing. 
Okay, so. Now when we go to the right hand, we don't start on the pinky. We start on the fourth finger. Okay? When we go to the right hand, we start on the fourth. Okay? So we put. Alright? So we start on here. So it'll be it's gonna feel weird. Alright? So we start on here. So it's one. So it's four, three, two, one. Four, three, two, one. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay? 